are Team 7254, the Robot Regulators. Um, we're a team based out of Shelby, but we take students all from all over the area, um, not just Utica Community Schools. We've won two matches today, and we've, only, we've lost one. So our first qualifier, it went poorly, but we had a lot of learning experiences. For example, we learned how to cooperate better. We learned uh, time management. Our second qualifier went really well. We ended up in third place. We won our qualifier with our sister team, and thanks to that, we're here. Our bot uses two Viper slides for motion. Uh, we have an intake mechanism with two custom silicone mold, molded 3D printed parts. And basically this intake uh, can go inside the submersible or pick up from um, anywhere on the field and it extends out. Uh, the outtake mechanism has a passive intake for clipping specimens. It's basically just a nylon and uh, TPU 3D printed part that will grip onto the specimen and hold it inside of it. And then once it needs to drop it, all it has to do is lower the level and it'll, the specimen will fall onto the chamber. We have seven motors. We also have custom designed parts on a robot like a front bumper designed by the CAD team. So our original design was a large robot with a semi-passive intake. Then we landed on the final design for this intake, which was silicone um, rubber wheels, which we found was much more versatile, can pick up from anywhere, and it was easier to fix and, and repair. I think my favorite part on being on the team is working with all my friends and coming up with a, a robot and and playing it on the field. I think my favorite part of the team is, especially as a driver, um, I love working with my teammates and I love collaborating. It's taught me a lot about communication and teamwork. Being part of the team and uh, helping build the robot 